Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this nice square root algebra problem? We have square root of x plus 4 plus square root of minus x minus 4 equals to 4. Now, to find the value of x, we can write it as square root of x plus 4 then plus square root of here we can factor minus out and write it as x minus into bracket x plus 4 as well then equals to 4 then in the next step let's take this x plus 4 which is common and represent it with a letter so let the letter m be equals to x plus 4 from here then we can write this now in terms of m and this will be square root of m then plus square root of minus m now equals to 4 and let's take root minus m to this side we call minus root minus m so we have square root of m now equals to 4 minus root minus m from here then <coughs> we can square both sides and then when we square both sides we have this square then also this square and from here the expansion on this side follows from a minus b and uh, which the same thing as a square plus b square minus 2ab and then from here the square cancel the square root we are left with m which is now equals to here we have 4 square plus root minus m square from here then minus 2 times 4 times root minus m and then from there this becomes m equals to here we have 4 square that's 4 times 4 that's 16 then square cancel square root so we have plus minus m that's minus m then we have you know that's minus 8 then root minus m and in next step we can take you know minus m to this side become plus so we have m plus m let's also take 16 here then become minus 16 then equals to we are left with minus 8 root minus m here then in next step we sum this this is 2m now then minus 16 equals to minus 8 then root minus m then what is common here is 2 we bring it out 2 into bracket m then minus 8 left inside then equals to minus 8 then root here we have minus m left inside then let's divide both sides by 2 from here so this by 2 and also this by 2 so that 2 we cancel out here we are left with m now minus 8 which is equal to here 2 go here 1 2 go here that's minus 4 that's minus 4 then root minus m and in the next step we can square both sides here again so we square this side and also we square this side then the square here also becomes m square plus 8 square minus 2 times m times 8 that's minus 2 times 8 times m then equals to here we have minus 4 square then times root minus m square so this square affect each of these and here this becomes m square plus 8 square is 8 times 8 that's 64 then minus here 2 times 8 that's 16 m equals to here we have minus
minus square root as plus, then 4 square root as 16. Then square can be square root here, we have 10 minus m now. Then 16 times minus m, that's minus 16 m as well. So we have m square plus 64 now. Then minus 16 m be equals to minus 16 m. Then from here we can add 16 m to both sides and then plus 16 m here, plus 16 m here. So this will cancel out from here, remain one on this side. And from here, it remains zero rather on this side. So we have m square now plus 64 equals to zero here. Then in the next step, now from here we can solve for him and if you are watching this you are yet to subscribe please support this channel by subscribing and also give a thumbs up and comment thank you now here you can take 64 here and this will become m square equals to minus 64 then let's take the square root on both sides now so square root here we cancel this square then square root here so we now have m here now b equals to plus or minus here we can separate this as root 64 and so it's minus 1 and the root 64 there is 8 and root minus 1 is i so we have m now to be equals to plus or minus 8i so we have two in you know, values for m here the first we have m equals to plus 8i And the second we have m equals to minus 8i. Then we should recall that uh, we represented m as x plus 4. So we can say x plus 4 now, which is m, now equals to plus 8i here. Then also x plus 4, which is m now, equals to minus 8i here. Then when we solve for x here, we can take plus 4 here, become minus. And same thing as writing x equals to minus 4 plus 8i. On this side, we have the value of x here, which is a complex you know, solution. And also here we have x equals to here. Also, plus 4 become minus, that's minus 4 minus 8i. And also we have another solution here, also a complex one. And we have come to the end of this class. We have gotten the two you know, solutions here. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more exciting videos. Turn the notification bell on. Give a thumbs up. Put your comment. See you next class. Okay. Bye for now.